So <laughs> this is just such a bizarre story. So it turns out that when Biden was vice president, um, he had several pseudonym accounts, accounts running off of his government computer, I guess, or his computers, that just were using pseudonyms. Now, as vice president, all your emails are supposed to be preserved. They all go into the archives. They're all accessible, ultimately. And all these pseudonym, pseudonymed accounts are all, uh, are all available. So if he used these pseudonym accounts for corruption, then he's a massive idiot because it's all there. It's all searchable. It's all available. And, and ultimately, the press or Congress is going to get their hands on it. There, there's no way in which Biden can actually uh, prevent that from happening unless he claims it's national security. But then it's bizarre that it's under uh, pseudonyms. So um, uh, slowly, uh, you know, but surely this is going to come out. And it's not just one pseudonym. It's several pseudonyms. Who knows what he was doing here? Who knows what he was engaged in? Um, now, one, up, one possibility is, of course, he's, he's, he's an idiot, which is not completely unreasonable. The guy's not exactly smart. Uh, he's not, certainly not off the chart smart. The other, the other uh, possibility, which I think is even more likely, is that he's just arrogant, the arrogant of power, the arrogance of power. They can't touch me. They can't get to me. Uh, I can do whatever I want. Nobody's ever going to look at these. Nobody's ever going to find them. And um, yeah, well, <laughs> I mean, his brilliant son, his, his uh, you know, intelligence runs in the family, I guess. His brilliant son actually, uh, you know, deposited his laptop, at a, you know, to be repaired and never went back to pick it up. So yeah, it's, um, it's uh, it, 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 that's how they're getting to all these pseudo accounts is through the laptop. Uh, who knows what's going to come of this? Who knows if, if Biden's super corrupt, um, if he was hiring prostitutes as he was traveling around the world and using a White House provided pseudonym in order to, to solicit them. Um, it, who knows? I mean, anything goes. I mean, it, it, these it, it, clearly Biden or anybody like that is they're not good people, right? They're not good people. So they're doing all kinds of weird stuff. But uh, yeah, let, let, let's, it's, it's going to be interesting to, to get insight into this, uh, given, uh, given how sloppy, stupid, arrogant, clearly Biden was, is, and all this is out there available. Of course, if it does come out and if it's, if it's really, really bad, then it's also going to be interesting to see how the Democratic Party responds to it and, and what uh, happens in terms of the 2024 election. Maybe, maybe, maybe um, the Democrats nominate somebody different than uh, Joe Biden. Uh, that, would be, that would be interesting. But um, yeah, a, a story to follow. It, nobody knows. I mean, the emails are not available yet. There, a few were released and they were redacted. Uh, but uh, there's both a Freedom of Information Act request by the media to get uh, the emails, and there's a request by uh, the government uh, uh, to get uh, to get them. So uh, exactly what they're all going to be discovering is interesting. Uh, there's also some argument that, well, there's also uh, you know some questions about Hunter Biden's use of Air Force Two. And Marine Two, these are the airplanes and helicopters of the vice president. During that time, how many times did he travel with his father overseas? What happened in those trips? So they're slowly gaining actual factual information about the potential real corruption of the Bidens. Um, as I've said from the beginning, the fact that the Biden is corrupt, the Bidens are corrupt, is not a surprise and should not be a surprise to anybody. It is my strongly held belief that pretty much everybody in Washington is corrupt to some degree or another. Some of them get caught. Most of them do not. Um, and, uh, and as I've said, uh, you know, maybe a, a highlight, uh, one of the, one of the uh, obvious ways in which it's corrupt is, 
is uh, is these kind of deals that they make uh, before and after leaving office, and uh, and and of course the every administration is filled with this, including um, including um, uh, uh, Trump and uh, Trump's son-in-law. All right, uh, let's see. So that's kind of Biden's emails. Something to watch. N nothing to get too excited about yet, but something clearly to watch.